Hello guys, Marian from uh, electroschematics.com Here uh, I have wired a normally closed uh, relay a fan and a 9 volt volts battery and uh, I have here connected to its coil, to the relay's coil DC voltage and now uh, the output uh, voltage from the power supply is zero so now uh, voltage is applied to the coil but as you can see the fan is spinning because uh, the normally closed relay has uh, its contacts closed that means uh, the current can flow through its contacts to the fan through to the load you can use uh, instead of the battery uh, you can connect the to 220 uh, mains voltage and here you can connect a bigger uh, this uh, ac fan or a light bulb you can uh, connect any kind of load in our case uh, i have a dc fan and a 9 volts battery so as you can see without voltage the relay connects the load to the power supply that is why it's called normally closed the initial state of the relay is closed and uh, the connection is uh, made through its contacts and now if i apply to 12 volts because uh, this uh, relay is a 12 volts one if i apply 12 volts the fan will stop will stop because uh, its uh, contacts uh, disconnected now it's opened and if it's opened uh, no current can flow through the relay and not uh, not even through the fan obviously now if i uh, turn off the power supply if i don't apply dc voltage to the coil to the relay the relay goes back to its initial state its default state meaning uh, normally closed and uh, the current flows as you can see now i apply voltage again to the coil the normally clo co uh, closed relay goes to its uh, open state and no current can flow i hope uh, you understood something from this video because i had <laughs> and uh, if you like uh, this video you can uh, subscribe to my channel if you go to my videos you will see there are more videos over there and you can learn a, lo a lot from it and uh, as usual uh, i will post a link below this video that uh, goes to the article where i wrote more uh, details about the normally closed relay thank you very much for watching see you next time